Now, let's make a folder for our ePortfolio. So we go File, a new folder, and we'll give the folder a name. Now, this is our root folder. Anything that goes on our website must be inside this folder. That includes our images. So I'm going to make a folder for our images, Shift Propeller N or New Folder. Um, let's call it Images. Now, anything that goes on there, uh, including things like our banners, must be in our uh, root folder and in this case it's an image that goes in our images folder now I'm going to make uh, folders now for each of the different parts of the website I'm going to start with databases and you can see it's got a capital D at the beginning of the name now that's not a good thing with websites so I'm going to write it all in lower case now I'm going to move on and make another new folder this time I'm going to do one for desktop publishing now, again, this has got uh, a couple of problems. One are the capital letters, so we need to do without that. Also, the space in the middle, and at the end of the day, it's also a really long name, so let's shorten that. Let's just call it DTP for desktop publishing. I'm going to do another one, um, which would be for spreadsheets. Now, again, that's a long word, capital letters, so I'm going to reduce that just to SS for short. And let's do another one. Uh, for multimedia which would have a hyphen and that's not good either too long capital letters same problems and there we have a set of folders for our ePortfolio <laughs>